Fire no bash Shaw tucking it around back at the Calgary net. There, Nathan Plessy throws a big hit, knocking Rookie. down D-man. But Forrest is in to scoop that up. Flicked one ahead that went off a skate back to the end wall. Plessy throws another big hit. He knocked down Forrest. Mm -hmm. What a trade uh, between the Mustangs and Okotoks Oilers last year as the Vans turn one over right in front of their own net. And Joe Carpation gets a shot right on Mitch Benson who blockers that one away from point blank range. But a penalty's coming up here to Brooks. Except there's a scramble in front of the net and the Mustangs score while falling to the ice a second time. Joe Carpation was wide open at the top of the crease and able to knock in the first goal of the game. The Mustangs strike first. It's 1-0. Yeah, you know, uh, the whole veteran core just squeezing her a little tight right now. So here's Boyko speeding in left wing of the circle. The rookie cuts to the slot, shoots and SCORES! Simon Boyko's first in the AJHL. He cuts to the slot from the left circle and sneaks a quick low wrister between the pads of Humble and the Bandits knotted up. It's one to one. Yeah, a real nice play by Arno Vasha on there. Just throws it up the wall to Boyko. Way Hewner flung it up the middle. Thompson gonna chase it down right circle and shoot. And he rang the right post with that one. By Ocean Wise, Lad couldn't get a two on one as Scalise intercepted back at his own blue and dropped it off for Salem to knock it ahead for Ryan Mashey. He'll carry in two on one with Orca. Mashey shoots. He scores! Not sure he got all of that one, but it snuck in short side. A little knuckleball wrister there is Ryan Mashey's first in the AJHL. And the Bandits have their first lead of the night. It's 2 1. Yeah, knuckleballer, and I think the goaltender. Where Bast shoves his man down. He's still got it to center. A dangerous hit by Tice in front of the Bandit bench on Klassen. But now Scalise has the puck cutting it in a breakaway. Backhander denied by Benson. Rebound backhander by Klassen. Goes off a body and wide. Centered again in the scramble in the slot. Is swept wide right by Klassen. Rune. And bounced ahead for a carry, and Chernichko's got a breakaway. He got by Sasana and shoots, and Benson robs him with a butterfly save. That's Dennis Sasana up the middle. Put it right wing side. It's out of the reach of Tice. Rolls in deep in the Mustang zone. Tice chases it down. Put it to the slot. It's off Plessy. He scores! <laughs> Settle it down for Brooks. Skates to the right point. Fed across mid blue line to Hubner. Fakes a shot. Now he shoots. Off a stick. Then a double deflection is in on Humble. Rebound. Gene shoots. He scores! Oh, like a pinball wizard down in the Mustang zone. That puck was bouncing around like nobody's business. But in the end, it comes to Connor Gene, and he has a wide open net. And all he had to do, Ken, was tap it in. Just tap it in, and it's 4-1 Bandits. And it comes to that, and Carangelo has it for Brooks. Carrying in right wing, got around Lentz, cuts out in front, shoots in a point blank, saved by Humble. Had their chances, a few breakaway chances, a few odd man Russians, but just, just unable to finish. Here come the Bandits now, up the middle, Sasana leads a three on two. Dishes off left side, Hamry returns to Sasana. He shoots, he scores! <laughs> oh, Rhode Island rocket from the left circle on the wrister by the captain. Set up by his former Kimball Union Academy teammate, and the Bandits make it a 5-1 to one game. Dennis Sasana pushes that puck up, throws it to Hammer. In the left wing corner, centering Thompson, backhanded across, off a stick, Boyko, shoots, what a save, Humble, rebound, he shoots, he scores! <laughs> Simon Boyko's got two on the night. If at first you don't succeed, you try and try again, and third time's the charm. 6-1 Brooks. Yeah, uh, this line really starting to find its way, but what a stop by Humble yeah. <laughs> on the first one. I mean, Boyko ha is on his back. He's gone along in the Bandits now with his 6-1 lead, uh, are in very good control of this hockey game. Left point shot by Scanlon, scores! <laughs> It may have been tipped in front by Tyler Van If it was, it'll be his first HAHL goal as they're coming fast. Fires it down to the opposing blue. Carangelo's got it. He's going to break away and on goal. Backhander, what a save by Humbo. Nice, though. Flings it to the mid-blue line for Bass. Now to Tice, right point. Skates in closer and shoots. He rang it off the crossbar, and it deflects over the, the end. Season. They're clearly much better choreographed. The two-on-one rush here. They feed it to the slot. Porter shoots right on. Rebound. Shot scores. That time in front of the net, it was Joseph Carpation with his second of the game. 
22's got two. Nice to see. Sasana in his own near corner. Banks one to neutral. Boyko's got a two-on-one with Gene. Boyko carries in, weaves to the high slot, dropped off Gene. He shoots. He scores! <laughs> a short side snipe by number 12 on a nifty setup by Simon Boyko. And the Bandits make it an 8-2 to two score. Yeah, the three-on-two develops. Connor Gene uh, gets it on his off wing. And Boyko flips over to get the shot, but it, no way Connor Jean cannot shoot that puck. Boyko's shot knocked away by Humble. And the puck battled for in the right wing corner. Flung to the right point, the keep in by Hammer. He'll cut mid-blue line, shoots it, stiff, scores! Carangelo! and deflect it down to the Bandit end, and that'll do it. The Bandits get their first win of the year. They down the Mustangs 9-2 in front of this home crowd on Anthony Pascarock night.